Well, Coach, uh, this year's softball team, I know you haven't had a chance to get them out to practice much, and it's a really young team, but what can you tell me about them? Uh, very young. Very excited. we got a lot of young players, but very skilled and talented young players. We're talking about girls that are coming right up to the ninth grade and moving right straight into varsity play. Um, their skill level is that good and that high. Very excited about it, along you know, with the new players coming up, along with our veteran returners of our seniors. we got a big senior class this year. I am very optimistic about our season. Very excited. Well, I guess softball, first thing comes to pitching. Uh, you have Caitlin Ewers back, and she's already signed to go to college. And I know you have some outstanding freshman pitchers, too. Can you we talk got, about um, your pitching? Yeah, we got Caitlin returning. Caitlin has really been working hard out of season and it's showing. Um, she's picked up some speed, um, not only with her throwing, but she's picked up speed as far as her body. Um, we're really excited with her having that experience that's gonna really pay off for us. And then the other young player, we're talking about the new versus the old or the young old, we've got Sierra Park, who is a freshman, and she can bring the ball right along. She's throwing just as if she was a senior as far as her speed, um, her type of throws, her variety of throws, um, and so when you put the young with the old, um, it's blended very well. Well, you haven't had a chance to hit very much, and uh, you're playing Friday. Uh, does that concern you? <laughs> yes, <laughs> it concerns me a lot because the weather seems like we've had more inside practice. Um, we're going to have the kind of fall back on just what comes natural, get out there. A lot of these girls, they're not rookies to softball because they've been, a lot of them have been playing year round. a lot of them play travel ball, a lot of them have been doing out of the season workout. So I am concerned about how many times we've been able to put a bat on the ball here at practice, but as far as the ability to hit, I'm not worried about that. I feel like I'll, once we get settled out in our great game, I think their natural hitting instincts is going to fall right into play. Um, but that has been a concern, the weather, trying to get outside and um, putting together the best lineup for our first game and um, see who can go where and who can do what. But we've got a lot of, a lot of skill and a lot of talent. What's your expectations for this team this year? Mm, that's a tough question. We're in a conference with a lot of um, We've got North Johnson who went to the Final Four last year. We've got Bun, we've got Corn Folders. Those three teams are very good and talented teams. Where are we going to fall in that of that mix? Um, I'm hoping the lowest we can come in is two. Um, uh, any coach, you always like to think of a conference championship. Um, but you know, any time we tell, North Johnson's got a girl that's already signed. Um, she's been pitching for many years. We're we're facing some good teams. Um, can we measure up? I hope so. I don't know if the youngness is going to be an issue as far as uh, game experience and how we do our program here. Um, but I feel like just looking at what we've got and knowing the teams of the past, I feel like we can be competitive right up there for the top spot. As far as the state playoffs, go make it past beyond that third round. We've made it to the third round several times, but we cannot seem to get over that hump. So state-wise, we want to make it past the third round of playoffs.